Hello YouTube, this is Super Drama Queen 21. This is my second video, and it's going to be a video critique. Um, as you can see, I have naturally curly hair. Yay, it's so boingy, and I love it. But um, anyway, this is a critique on the Herbal Essence line and Africa's Best Hair Grease. I'm sorry, hair and scalp conditioner, as they call it. But anyway, um, about a year ago, actually two years ago now, I decided I was going to go natural. Um, in June, no, June of 2000, in, I want to say 2010, I decided that I was going to do my BC, which is a big chop, and it's when you cut all your permed hair off and leave nothing but your cool, natural hair. Anyway. What I did was, <clears throat> I cut my hair until it was about that long, and that was about seven months ago. It's now January 23rd, 2011, and this is the length my hair is. If I take the glasses off, you can see that in the front, it's now down to here, right about to the middle of my lip. And on the sides, it is to the this part of my neck. And in the back, well, it touches my shoulder. Ooh, excuse me, but that's no real feet because, as you can see, I have no neck worth talking about. Um, let's see. I've tried Hello Hydration. I have also tried Totally Twisted. And I've tried this one, which is called None of Your Frizziness. There we go. So the glare is not in the way. And this is None of Your Frizziness Leave-In Conditioner. Now, I didn't like Hello Hydration's um, fragrance because I do not like um, the smell of coconut. It kind of bothers me. Um, I also did not like Totally Twisted's fragrance because it was, I don't even know what it was. It just, you know, it was like floral and it made me sneeze. And I didn't like how my hair looked with Totally Twisted. And I didn't like how my hair looked with Tossing Me Softly either. I didn't like the way my hair looked or felt with Tossing Me Softly or smelled. My God, that made me sneeze even worse than Totally Twisted. Um, but I really am a fan of the None of Your Frizziness. And it is an anti-frizz conditioner. Um, when I need to clarify my hair because sometimes it gets oily, especially during the summer... When I need to clarify my hair, I use the uh, um, None of Your Frizziness um, shampoo. It's freaking awesome. And then I follow it up with a VO5. Um, VO5, I think it's the pomegranate one. I use that one for my co-wash. And then I finish off with the Herbal Essence None of Your Frizziness. Um, about a month ago, I started using the None of Your Frizziness um, leave-in conditioner. It smells wonderful. I can say that, but it's not heavy enough for my hair. Um, even though it's a thin strand, see, you might not can even see the one I'm pulling right now, but it's a thin strand, but it's so much of it, it's thick, and it needs something to help weigh it down and manage it. But um, this was not heavy enough. It wasn't heavy enough, so I had to end up adding some of this to it, giving it a little shake, and then booyah, it was good. I also like to use... Africa's best super grow to help weigh my hair down as well as lock in the moisture. Um, the method that I adapted for my hair was from Terry LaFleche's total, um, I believe she calls it the tightly curly method. And I'm going to put her website down in the little dialogue box down there so you guys can get acquainted with her. If you've never seen Terry LaFleche, she has the most amazing hair ever. It's like really, really long and really, really curly and awesome. And she'll just walk you through her st her technique step by step. Um, I like to call her hair the um, awesome curly Rapunzel hair. I think it's beautiful. But um, anyway, this is my hair at seven months. That's my length and everything. And these are the, these are what I use my um, hair helpers as I like to call them. They're what I use to help my hair out, and um, then I just braid it up at night so it doesn't get, you know, pulled out or anything, and sleep on your satin pillowcase and you'll be good. So that's um, my critique. Once again, thank you so much for watching my video. Subscribe if you want to. Please do let me know if you like it or hate it, you know. I'd like to know. Um, so thanks once again, and I'll talk to y'all later. Bye.